Right. Good afternoon, guys. In the previous class, we discussed a program to fetch all palindrome words from the given list, right? Okay. Let us see one more program. One more program. Right. Uh, in that program, let's imagine a string. One string is there. The string contains n number of words. For example, let's take a Right, so Python, Narayana, Tech House, n number of words are there. <clears throat> okay, n number of words. Now, how to reverse the words? How to reverse the words in the given string? Reverse the words means, like, uh, for example, the last word in the given string is house, should come in the beginning, like a uh, house. Next, uh, Tech, next one, Tech is coming, then. Uh, Narayana, right? Uh, Narayana, and then Python, right? This is the reversing the given, reversing the words in the given string, guys. Okay, right. Let's make the question here. That number is 36. 36. Write a program to reverse, to reverse the words, the words in the given string. Reverse the words in the given stringer. There was only words in the given stringer. Right? So here, what is the process means? First, what we do, we have to, we have to split it. If you split it, if you split it, then it becomes a list, right? So for splitting, what we use, ST dot to split, we use split. So that, what is the result now? So Python, separate, Narayana, separate, tech, separate, house is a separate. Right, all are separated in the list format, right? In the list format. If you want, let us let us see here on this one, on this one, right? So list format, all words came in the list format. In the list format, right? Now from this list, uh, I am going to take one by one and uh, keep in the reverse order, guys. So to reverse a given string, to reverse a given list uh, or given tuple, we can use the slicing, right? Uh, we can use slicing, right? Uh, slicing means, uh, uh, you know, like this. <coughs> Starting value, double colon, increment value. Both are minus values you take. This is the zero, right? Generally, this is the one, this is the two, this is three, the forward. The backward, uh, this is the minus one, minus two, minus three, minus one. So our starting value here, minus one. So minus one is the starting value. Increment value, how much here? So so next one I want here, next one. Means one is the increment value. Which one? Minus one. Because backward reading, right? Reading minus one. So minus one starting value and minus one increment value. So this is starting value, minus one. And I'm going to read which direction? Read which direction here? I'm going to read in this direction. That's why increment value is the minus value. Starting value minus uh, increment value which one uh, minus one uh, so that so it takes a uh, one by one under the reverse order, right? Now let's take here so which one uh, starting value minus one increment value also minus one. Let me run this one. Let me run this one. Yes. So now it is reverse, guys. House came in the beginning. And Python came in the ending, right? They were stuck. But output came in the which format? List format, right? List of words. List of words. But what I want now, we want to join all as a single string like this. We want to join all as a single string. So I mean, this is the list, right? <clears throat> this is the list. All of you. Result of this split index sizing is what here? This list. Now this one I'm going to join, right? Uh, so we have the join function, right? We have the join function, right? We have the join function. Uh, so, and also we need space, right? Between every two words, uh, space is there, right? We have the space. So, we take here, we take here uh, space dot join off dot join off. That's all. Now, let us see here. Let us see now. Yes, guys, right? We got the required output here. All of you. So, in the reverse, uh, what is there here? House, uh, tech, uh, narayana, python. Actually, it is uh, which one? Python, narayana, tech, house. 
the reverse uh, house tech uh, narayana python came this is the way how to reverse how to reverse the given words uh, in the string in the string guys right in the string all of you so here we use which function we used the join and the split function in a single line it is happened all of you okay this is one of the ways to do this operation guys and uh, thank you so much we'll try the next example the next session thank you all of you guys bye